Hey everyone, welcome back to The Last of Us Remastered. So in the last part, we finished off in this neighbourhood, just scavenging what we could from all the houses. And um, we're still heading towards that tower over there, the radio tower where Sam's group is going to be and we're hopefully going to join up with them. So we're going to drop down at the, ba at the back of this, um, out this backyard, into the streets. Get out! <laughs> Fucking sniper. Do you see where it came Somewhere down the street. Right now. Y'all stay here. No! Before you start, I need you guys to keep him busy. I'm gonna go around and see if I can't get the angle on him. Okay. Hey. Be careful. So this is another section that's pretty difficult in the game. And the sniper at the back at the end of the street can take you out with one bullet. And I think that doesn't actually matter what difficulty you play on, he will take you out. So this is a this is one of the hardest parts to play, no matter what difficulty you're playing on. So we're gonna move cover to cover when he takes his shots. I know there's a way to take on this a route where you can go to the left hand side and pretty much take no damage by um, taking a specific route where you don't actually have to fight anyone either if you time it perfectly. But I've never ex um, never att attempted that, so I've got no experience in taking that route. In my previous um, playthroughs, I've always took the right hand side. Shit, there's a guy there. So this time. I'm just going to do what I always do and take my time going up the right hand side. I grab this guy as he comes in, take him out the door. Because the sniper in this as well, he can actually take you out while you're in a house by shooting you through a window. So we're going to grab that um, baseball bat there. It's got more hits on it than our steel pipe did. I'm going to quickly run downstairs just to get away from that window. When he takes a shot, we'll make a run to the kitchen. So he's took a shot, we'll make a move. Because he takes sh um, time between each shot where he's got to obviously um, reload his clip. Or, you know, because it's like a bolt action rifle he's using. Whoa, God. So we're going to keep scooting forward, moving from cover to cover here. Hard behind these, these blogs. Going to move to the car next when he takes a shot like that. Get behind this car. Next time we'll move to the car on the left. So he took a shot there. Do Get going? down again. I'm gonna move from this car now to the board in front of the car. You crying behind that car? And next we're gonna move to the house to the right. You can't actually see the guy on the window. You can just see his gun. Shit, he took two quick shots there. But we take longer between shots. We're gonna move to the back of the house next. So we took a shot. Move to the back of the house. Maybe go around the back of the house. Oh god, this guy's there actually. Um. Okay. Shit. Let's get this pistol. Take out that guy. That's got no ammo left. That guy's got a Molotov on him. I wanted to take him out in case he got any closer with that. I've got an arrow we can possibly use on this guy. So we took him out. Just quickly make sure there's no one coming behind us. Okay, it looks like actually there's a Molotov we can pick up there. Off this guy's body. So that's good. Nice, we actually got some more ammo there as well. It's quite dark back here. Shit, there's a guy behind us. Where's he going? He was behind us. Looks like he might be going through the house to get to us. Let's quickly keep our eyes out. Where you going, huh? Where you going? There he is. Is that the same guy? He looks different. I swear the other guy wasn't wearing a hood. Okay, here he is. We're gonna actually step back a bit behind that cover. Just so we can get a better angle on him. Whoa, shit. Okay, so let's get this guy. When he, if he goes down, we'll pop out. Okay, we missed a fair shot, but we still got him. Got We've got three bullets in total. I want to quickly check this guy, check his body. See if he's got any ammo on him. What a bitch, he hasn't. Okay, so we are very limited now. We actually did get a Molotov there, so we can still 
take out a group of enemies if they're close enough to each other. I want to quickly check inside this house, see if there's anything we can pick up. I'm, just gonna, I'm only going to check the kitchen actually, I'm not going to go upstairs. Because the last the house that we were in, there was nothing upstairs. And the, this this um, whole area looks like it's pretty much populated by the hunters. We've got some sugar. We're going to be as safe as we can and not go near any windows. So by going upstairs in this house, we would go be, be going past a few windows. And I don't really want to risk that. I'm just going to continue as much as I can. So we, we have got, I think, enough ammo. Actually, as well, we fired that bow and arrow, didn't we, before? And I think the arrow must have snapped on the guy because I didn't get an option to pick it up when I went near his body. So the sniper is in that house with the window in the roof. So I, feel, I don't think he's actually got a shot on us from here. But still, we're going to move cover to cover quickly. Just to be safe. Shit, we got some reinforcements coming in. Let's see if we can maybe throw a Molotov at these guys. Can't actually get close enough there. Crap. That was awful. I'm going to move a bit closer. Get down. I'm going to have to throw a Molotov here because I've got no options really. Hopefully we'll get two There's actually two guys behind that box in the front. So it might be worthwhile actually getting a bit closer to them and throwing the Molotov. So my ammo is very l limited right here. Quickly move to this car on the left. So I think we've got three guy four guys now actually. I'm gonna throw a Molotov at these. I think we got two of them. I hope we did anyway. So get down behind there's actually um, an open way there. We've got to be careful we don't get flanked. I think that guy's got body armor on as well in front of us. So it's going to be... Oh god, there's still three more guys. My only option here with this weapon I've got equipped is to run right in behind this house. Because if I try and take these guys on with it, this weapon has not got the range. So make a run. Shit. Possibly get behind this car and see if they chase me. Actually going to make a run for it. Right, the house we've got to get into is that one with the green um, hood over the door. So we're just going to make a run to it towards the um, sniper. Quickly pick up, pick up these blades, we might need them in the future. Okay, there's the front door. Can I go upstairs? I think it's this way, I'm not sure. This guy should be in here. No, shit, wrong way. Okay, more stairs to go up. He's on the top floor, I know that. So I'm sure he's in here. He's going to... He's going to... Jump on us. We're going to mash square to get him off us quickly. Joel's going to go a bit psycho. Knife him about six times. Right, here's um, the rest of our group. Ellie, Joel and Henry. Not Joel, Sam. So we're going to have to snipe these guys. I want to make sure every shot counts. There's a guy behind there. We got more guys jumping down. Take that guy out before he actually gets down. There's a guy on the right. It's a bad shot. Imagine if these guys dropped down behind us straight away. That would have been terrible. I'm not sure if um, Henry and Sam can actually take out these guys. I think I might have to shoot them all. They might just um, distract them with a few shots. Come on, guys. The left hand side now doing the houses. It's a nice headshot. So this gun as well as it being a one shot kill on me, it's also a one shot kill shot kill on the enemies. So it doesn't matter where you shoot them, you can shoot them in the arm, the legs, anywhere, as long as you land a hit on the body, you can take them out. So I'm trying to quickly spot where there's any oh god, there's a tank there. Well, not a tank, but, you know, a gunner. I don't think I can take this out. I'm trying to see if I can shoot through the hole. Okay, 
Okay, we got a bunch more reinforcements coming on the right hand side. Make every shot count. Nice little headshot. And the guy on the right. It's a good job this same um, sniper as well stocked up at ammo, isn't it? Oh, that guy just crouched just in time to evade that shot. I'm gonna get this guy on the right quickly. Pop your head up. Oh, he's not moving, is he? Good guy, that guy instead. The truck's getting closer and closer now. Here's the guy popping out the top. He's opened this hatch. He's also thrown molotovs out. So we're gonna have to take a shot on this guy. As soon as he pops his head up. Nice. Shit. Oh, so that's how some of the houses get holes in them. People crash cars. Oh, that was intense. You alright, Sam? Yeah, I'm okay. Thanks, Joel. I wouldn't be walking around in the ump in the street Look at this. just yet. I'd still be hiding. We did it. We should move. Yeah, don't stand up straight in the open. Sam! <laughs> Shit, we got Henry! infected on top of him. Um, Henry and Sam took him out. Sam, are you okay? Where did they come from? Yeah, yeah I'm fine. You sure? I said I'm fine. Come on, come on! Let's move! So we got more infected coming in there. We got a bunch of them coming actually from the back. I want this sniper rifle like full time. It's so powerful. Couldn't get that one. Shit. Look how many there are. Where are these all coming from? The sewers? If we close the door to the sewers. Sounds like a run for it. There's too many there. You need a tank to take these out. You're okay. I'm still here. Anybody hurt? Uh -oh. No, we're good. I think it's time we quit this place. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Shut the hell up. That's serious. It's Tommy's birthday, and that's all he wanted to do is just rent two Harleys and drive cross country. Oh, man. I could die happy if I could just ride one around the block. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like? It was good. It was real good. Good? C can you believe this guy? Come on, man, give me details. Describe it. <laughs> you know what? You two deserve a little privacy. No, no, Ellie, Ellie. This isn't just any regular motorcycle, okay? You get on that bad boy, you feel that engine? Nothing like it. Oh, yeah, how would you know? Seen it in my dreams. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't think anyone from my group is gonna show up. Yeah. Worst part about it all, explaining it to Sam. Well, it's safe to say those two have officially bonded. What are you doing? Taking stock of all the food we found today. I see. And how are we doing on canned peaches? Did Henry send you? No. Why would Henry send me? To make sure I'm not fucking up somehow. I'd say we all did pretty good back there. Especially you. Is everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. 
Okay. Well, have a good night. How is it that you're never scared? Who says that I'm not? What are you scared of? Uh, let's see. Scorpions are pretty creepy. Uh, being by myself. I'm scared of ending up alone. What about you? Those things out there. What if the people are still inside? What if they're trapped in there without any control of their body? I'm scared of that happening to me. Okay. First of all, we're a team now. Okay, we're gonna help each other out. And second, they might still look like people, but that person is not in there anymore. Henry says that they've moved on, that they're with their families, like in heaven. Do you think that's true? I go back and forth. I mean, I'd like to believe it. But you don't. I guess not. Yeah, me neither. Oh, all the serious talk, I almost forgot. There, if he doesn't know about it, he can't take it away. All right, I'm pooped. I'll see you tomorrow. That smells good. Good morning. Where's Sam? I let him sleep in for once. Oh. Well, if you want him to join us, you can go wake his ass up. Okay. Sam? <laughs> Sam! What the hell? <laughs> Shit, he's turning! <laughs> That's my fucking brother! <laughs> Screw it! <laughs> Shit! Really? Gotta go, you're right. Uh -huh. Oh my god. Sam? Oh no. Sam? Henry? Henry, stay there. Henry? Uh, what have you done? I'm gonna get that gun from me, okay? Oh, okay, okay, easy. This is your fault. This is nobody's fault, Henry. It's all your fault! Henry! Henry, no! Oh my god. Such a fucking crazy scene. I remember the first time I seen that, my jaw was hanging. I couldn't believe just how you lose two, like, characters that quick, just all of a sudden. And he shoots himself? He'd rather kill himself, and then live without his brother. Ugh. So we're in the fall now, it's just said in the bottom right, we've actually jumped forward a bit as Ellie and Joel have carried on. They travel towards the Fireflies. Means we're close to Jackson City, right? Should be more than a few miles. You ready to see dear old brother? I'm just ready to get there. You nervous? I don't know what I'm feeling. Okay, so Joel's brother is close now. He's going to hopefully find him. And he'll lead us to their fireflies, as he used to be a firefly. And we'll um, hopefully find his brother in the next part, guys. So, I'm going to end it here. Bye!